The footprint from bestorderflow.com is easy to configure to show imbalances. First, we need to identify what balance is. And the balance, like in this candle, is thorough matching orders on both sides. We see 20 and 54, we see 34 and 41, we see 29 and 54, we see 15 and 39, 12 and 22. This is very thorough matching orders on both sides, on both directions. This is more a balanced candle. Imbalances, it's when there is an inner disbalance on the one side orders are severely overmatching another side. This candle is moving upwards. That's why I can see that there is a 1 on the left side on a bead and there is a 12 on an ask. I see that there is like a 15 on an ask and there is a 7 on the bead. So this is disbalance or inner imbalance inside of this candle. Beads are not really fighting. There is like three contracts, one, zero, one, zero, one, zero, one, zero, one, one, four, and so forth. Here there is a some fight happens, but then it's again like seven, five. It's really, or two, it's really insignificant. Compared to this candle, you see like, 9, 27, 15, 29. So in this candle, I call it expansion. This candle expansion is because there's a buyers more aggressive compared with sellers. Sellers are giving up. That's why this candle moves really fast. Quite often, this candle can break the structure on the left. And when there is a more than one imbalances happens like in this situation like a one imbalance here another over here another over here it becomes a zone when we open properties we can see the formula to calculate imbalances and zones here's a property for imbalances the most important option is the imbalance ratio imbalance ratio in percentage is 210 that means one side should be 210 or 210% higher than another side. For example, beads should be 210% higher than ask, and then the ask should be 200% more than the beads. When these beads overpower the ask, the candle moves down. When the ask overpower the beads, then the candle move upward. 